Hi, Vanessa, Jenny, nice Hi, to yeah, see Jenny. you. Oh, thanks so much for taking time out of your busy day to show us around your new office. We're really excited here. Well, we're excited to, to be here. Today. <laughs> we're good. Um, before we start the tour, um, let's share a little bit of information about each of you. I know we've all met before, but some of our viewers may not have seen that episode. So let's tell them, um, for instance, Vanessa, where did you come from? Well, I came from Charlotte. Mm -hmm. um, this was an adventure for me. Um, Great. Our children were grown and my mom's in great health so my husband and I decided to come to the beach and I'm gonna finish working my career here. Oh well, great, great. And how about you Jenny? Well I'm originally from New York from Queens and Long Island and moved to North Carolina about 11 years ago. Started with Novant about three years ago. Mm -hmm. Prior to that I was working in Wilmington in an endocrinology office. Well, good. Well, we're happy to have you guys down here. Now, let's talk a little bit about this new name because I can't quit calling it the old thing. So the new name is? Oh, boy. It is Novant Family and Internal Medicine, South Brunswick. Novant Health Family and Internal Medicine, yes. South Brunswick, yes. right? That's right. That's that is a mouthful. A mouthful. That is right. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Well, um, now I understand that um, there's been a, a little expansion of your services here. It looks huge here. So let's talk about the new providers that are on the way. Well, we are fortunate that we have a wonderful internal medicine physician coming, that's Dr. Bell, Great. and we're going to expand our services to include family medicine, mm -hmm. and we have Dr. Stephanie Scott coming in August for that uh, part of our practice. Wow, that sounds like you're gonna have a wonderful team here. I love the incorporation of the family medicine into the internal mm -hmm. medicine practice to have both options available to in this end of the county. Mm -hmm. That's a great, great Yeah, I think it's gonna be a wonderful thing for the for folks who live in this area yeah. to be able to access medicine no matter their age. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, I'm really excited to see the office. So how about let's get started on the tour? Sure, let's go ahead. Right. Well, this is our check-in right uh -huh. here. When patients yeah. first so this come is in. the first thing they see. Mm -hmm. They come in the front door and they check in right here. That's right. And then we have a beautiful lobby. It is a beautiful lobby. It's so airy mm -hmm. and bright. Beautiful paintings to look at while you're waiting yeah. to relax you. Yeah. <laughs> then once the nurses have finished up, mm -hmm. you know, setting up all the uh, charting, they'll come pick up the patient here and take them inside. So right. let's go that way. All right. Okay. Which way? Now the first stop. Okay. The first stop for patients will be this. This is our check-in station. This is where patients get weighed. Mm -hmm. um, they may do their um, pulse oxygen levels. Um, mm -hmm. And the, the nurses will start the charting right there. Then they'll escort them to, a, to an exam room down the hall. Okay. And we can take a look at this exam room if this you like. This is a great okay. example. Oh, this is nice. Like the window. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I'm standing in front of you. This is nice. So we have all our equipment in here. Mm -hmm. Everything's set up. It's locked. They're all locked, <laughs> They're all locked as they the should be. be. Yeah. So each each clinician, yeah, each clinician is set up to do everything they need to do mm -hmm. right from here. They don't have to go back outside to get anything. Mm -hmm. And one thing I like too is in this setup, the uh, clinician is sitting at the computer. You have an opportunity to face your patient. Mm -hmm. And we have room in this office for the patient's family member or significant other to join in the visit. And that's mm -hmm. good. That is nice because I've heard patients say, he or she doesn't look at me anymore because yeah. you know mm -hmm. you're looking at the screen yes. and so that's really important that you make that connection, that exactly. eye connection with your patients. And we can turn this around sure. to completely the involve the patient in the electronic part mm -hmm. of their visit as well. Great. So that's good. Great. Okay, lead the way. Okay. Well, this is one of our nurses' stations, mm -hmm. and here are two of our Who nurses. Are these lovely young ladies? <laughs> this is Stephanie Taylor. She is an LPN with us, and this is Stephanie Mayers who is one of our MAs. Could you make it any harder? Two <laughs> Stephanies. Okay. There well, were three. We We've made it easy. Three? Oh, yes. we're making progress. Well, hey, ladies. It's nice to see you. Nice yes. to meet you. Good. We're excited to have you guys here. Excited as well. Good, good. I know that uh, the patients are going to love this space. It's really, really nice. So. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you. 
talk a little bit about the services that are offered here. Um, what all um, do we have? What all? Well, we have our own laboratory. Mm -hmm. And um, as of this week, radiology moved into the space next door. So now we no longer have to refer patients down to the hospital or to Sunset Beach. They can walk out one door and into another mm -hmm. to have x-rays or MRIs scheduled, which is a great service for our patients. It's mm -hmm. so much easier for, the, for them. We do mammograms locally, uh -huh. and we're going to be having that um, mobile MRI machine come, and so that will really be a good thing. Yeah, I think it's going to be here one day a month yes. on uh, yeah, once or Thursday, mm -hmm. uh -huh. and then uh -huh. uh, mobile MRI will be here on a Wednesday, I believe. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, that's great. And is that out back? Is that behind the building? It is. Yes. There's yeah, a there's a pad, a, a pad back there. Mm -hmm. Okay, wonderful. Wonderful. Um, other services? Um, we're, we have some uh, partners that are joining us in this space. We have um, OBGYN and we have our surgical partners joining us. That's just started, so we're very excited about that. And we really hope to expand those services and maybe bring other specialists to this mm -hmm. area. And that's kind of on the other side of the building, correct? It's correct. These are kind of like mirror mm -hmm. uh, spaces. So yeah. they're, they won't be in here where, right. where you all are. They'll have plenty of space, space on, down, have their down own spaces. The other end so the that's really That's nice. right, yes. That, that's and OBGYN and surgery have already started with this. Urology is expected to begin um, coming to the office in May. Oh, wow. That'll be great. We're, we're expanding so, quickly. And none of those offices are, are closing in the other areas. This no. is just in yeah. addition to mm -hmm. all their other correct. practices, yeah. correct? There's mm -hmm. just so much growth in this part of the, county, part of the county that, you know, we're just going to expand and accommodate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Did you want to look at a procedure sure, room? Let's this is one of the rooms room. that we use. What do we do in a procedure room? <clears throat> We can do a lot of things in procedure rooms. We can do joint injections. We can do what we call an IND, which is incision and drainage of somebody that has, you know, an abscess mm -hmm. on the skin. There are a number of um, surgical, minor surgical procedures that we can do in here. Yeah, we have cryotherapy mm -hmm. services oh. for freezing off lesions. Oh, you can do that. Mm -hmm. We do that here. Um, we certain lesions respond better to uh, electric artery, and we have that ability to mm -hmm. that nice fresh space it is it's mm -hmm. so clean it mm -hmm. smells like a new car <laughs> <laughs> it's great in here okay right. so what's up next I guess the lab great let's go so tell me about the lab here what do we do in the lab what services and do you have to send anything out well, we do. This is a, basically a drawing station drawing for station. us. I mean, there are a few things that we do in house, mm -hmm. but the main value for this of this facility is that we can draw blood and send it to um, our lab partners for processing, mm -hmm. and we get a quick turnaround. We have results of most tests within 24 hours, okay. and then again we can release those to my chart, and the patient gets a chance to take a look at them. Um, if they're coming in, they get a chance to look at them, digest the whole sure. scenario, and get their questions ready for when they come in for the visit. Um, and sometimes it's just we can send a note along saying, you know, your no lab is good, everything is fine, we don't need to do anything different. Mm -hmm. But this is a huge expansion. Um, we have a facility here for two people to draw blood mm -hmm. in this um, in this lab, so I think that's going to be good. I think we're going to be able to accommodate. Well, I think in growth. an office this size with as many providers as you all are going to have, I think it's good to have that, that at least two drawing mm -hmm. stations. Then there's yes. no wait. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Better for yeah. the patients. Yeah. So it's a real pleaser for patients. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, great. Well, if someone um, is watching our show and they would like to make an appointment, how might they do that? Well, they can call 910-579-8363. That's our telephone number. It's still the same. Still the same. In right. case That's anybody good. remembers our old number, it's still the same. Mm -hmm. um, if you're a patient, and uh, already a patient of ours, you can actually schedule appointments online through right. my chart as well. Yeah. Um, and we're taking new patients. You are taking new mm -hmm. patients. That's what I want to know. Yeah. We are taking yeah. new patients. Yeah, that's great. And as soon as the other two providers come, I'm sure you'll be taking many more new many patients, yes, right? Yes, yes. Right. Yeah. And, you know, I'm going to say this about mm -hmm. Jenny. Jenny's uh, time in endocrinology has made her quite an expert in managing. I have actually heard that. Yes. 
She's very good at managing problem diabetic cases, uh, thyroid cases, things like that. She uh, often sees patients for um, providers in other offices. Mm -hmm. So um, some of the patients have their primary care uh, services provided somewhere else, but come to Jenny oh, really? to get their mm -hmm. thyroid. I didn't know that was an option. Yes, that, that, is, an that option. is an option. That's I see great. patients not only from no other Novant physicians, but right. from outside practices. Um, I'll get referrals from those. From, from an those. independent mm -hmm. physician. Yeah. Great. Well, that's awesome. So they can just um, call and, and inquire and see what's right. available and exactly. make an right. appointment. Great. Well, thank you both so much for you, um, having us today. Uh, you're gracious and we're just pleased to have you here in this new space. And, and I know you're going to be very, very successful. So thank you. Thank you thanks so much. again. Thanks for coming. You're mm -hmm. welcome.